today it is Wednesday the 17th. I actually remember that because it's my friend's birthday today. <laughs> today is the day I'm sending the lease, the signed lease and paying the deposit and all of that stuff. So I'm doing that today, which I feel like it's quite symbolic of me to start this vlog of the moving process today. Let me actually send all the paperwork and then I will get back to the vlog. Ciao! Ooh. I went to put on a wig just for Oklahoma Peace Um But so I've just sent through all the paperwork and we're moving, guys. We're moving. Finally, give manifestile and Quenzeka. As you can hear, this building is doing loke doing aku, which is making noise. There's been work being done to this place since i came back to joburg and they started before i left for christmas holiday um i'm i'm just i'm very over it i'm very over it yeah. like this is kind of ridiculous guys uh, i mean i know it's temporary but it's just like you guys are taking so long with the whole process that it just it's disruptive, especially for people who are living within a time where a lot of us are working from home. Um, that's besides the point. Oxalayo, I'm happy to be <laughs> I'm so excited to show you guys um, the place that I chose. I'll show you the places that I went to view as well. Uh, I viewed three places in total, mainly because I just... I wasn't feeling it. Guys, moving is a lot of work. I I hate it. And hopefully, me moving now is where I'm going to stay until I buy a house or something. Because moving! Oh, hell no. 10 out of 10. Do not recommend. So, the first apartment, um, I wanted this with my whole heart and soul. Everything was basically perfect about this. Look at that view. Yeah, everything was basically perfect about this apartment, um, except the bathroom, which you will see later. But literally in my list of things to look out for, I had like my place must have a double sink because right now I have a single sink um, and it needs to have a shower because right now I have a bath that's also a shower. And as Zama would say, it's given me a lot. The place in its entirety is actually perfect. Um, so I wanted this really bad and I applied for it, but apparently someone got to it before me. So whatever. Uh, in retrospect, I'm glad that I actually didn't get it because the apartment that I have now is pretty much the same price, but more space. So <laughs> I win. apartment was the view was just breathtaking so peaceful so serene stunning um yeah i can't think of anything actually bad to say about this place i really wanted this apartment as well um i think the only thing that really made me not choose it is that the one that i chose has more space um even though you guys will see the one that I chose has carpet, uh, which was also one of the things that I just didn't want to compromise on. But it's it's just worth it. Whereas this one has like the perfect flooring, the perfect modern finishes. The outside does look a little bit outdated. So I'm glad that the landlord actually took the time to update the place inside. But yeah. I have nothing bad to say about this place. Um, the bathroom is perfect. The rooms are perfect. It is spacious, just not as spacious as the one that I chose. Ciao. <laughs> had 
anxiety for the last month um, about this moving process and I suppose it happened for a reason because I found the perfect place and I just I don't think I'll want to leave until I'm buying a place anyways which was my intention from the beginning but yeah I guess everything else will kind of unpack um, during the course of the video where I'll just chat to you guys yeah so it's also kind of why I disappeared as well off of YouTube um, I just started getting very demotivated it's like I'm kind of living here because I don't have a choice but for one my couch and coffee table are gone because I gave that back to my mom because I didn't really like it and moving to this new place I kind of want to make it more my style so got rid of some heavy duty furniture which it's fine because at least I can have my clothing rail up as you would have seen if you watched my previous haul but it means that I, I can't really do a lot of videos in the space that I like to do them in in this house because I don't really like shooting in my room um but besides the layout of the place because I feel like had I had the motivation to actually shoot I could have I didn't I was just so stressed out and I literally could not think I was so uninspired I'm just but I feel like with moving it's just clearing the fog from my brain and just opening a new dimension of where my creativity can take me um, in terms of this channel and the content I can make with space that I'll have. You guys are going to love it. Oh my gosh. Ah, it's going to be amazing. But yeah, so that is, this is day one of the moving series. Um, I want to start packing, but I still live here. You know what I mean? So it's like, what do I start packing? What do I not? Also, like my things in the bathroom, for example, they already are in like their own storage baskets and like their own storage units. Or my shoes, for example, if you guys know, my shoes stay like in the storage boxes. It's like, it doesn't make sense for me to take them out of that just to put them in another box. You know what I mean? So like with things that are already in their own storage, I'm figuring I could just put them in my car and drive them there as opposed to putting them in the moving truck. You know what I mean? But yeah, I'm just, I feel like, <laughs> I don't know when the right time to start packing is. <laughs> Probably next week because I really don't think it's gonna take me that long but yeah okay I'm talking too much day one let's freaking go <laughs> so well uh, remember all that crap I told you guys about packing last week on the 17th <laughs> it's definitely the 23rd and I haven't done anything but I'm back because obviously that means I'm about to do something um first things first I'm gonna put the boxes I'm gonna build the boxes and then I'm gonna start packing things into them why is my angling so rubbish serene but yeah let's do this Just about finished filling up the first box. This is all just skivas. <laughs> and I just think it's funny how they. <laughs> so I'm just gonna carry on doing that until this box is full, and then I'm gonna grab another one and do more tops. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna categorize the boxes like that so it'll be tops. Um, pants and then I think I'm gonna get uh, bin bags for coat hanger things because I saw someone do it I've been watching a lot of moving vlogs <laughs> just for some tips and tricks I saw someone like put their coat hanger things in those drawstring big bin bags so that like 
the, the hook of the hanger is like outside of the drawer. You guys will see when I do it if I decide to do it, okay? So I went to the shops and came back. I uh, didn't take you guys because I was just gonna go in and out. But I got the bin bags. This is like my win for today. This looks so good and it's so quick. It's literally taking me two seconds to do all of this. Look at that. Look at that. It's working. Ah! <laughs> and the bin bags are like scented. I didn't know they were scented, but they are, which means like. The clothes are gonna get there and smell like they've been in like some fabric softer. Soft soft softener. How? Even if I can go to sleep and stuff now, like it's fine. I didn't get today. I didn't get today. <laughs> current state of the nation yeah yeah I just took a shower hence the bezeling like a queen <laughs> I just did my skincare routine um, I'm so tired guys um, I've just yeah I've, I've pretty much done like 40% of the apartment because that room alone was 40% I just need to get more boxes so that I can carry on and I feel like had I had more boxes today I would have done more because I've been getting jalo, been getting jalo. like when it's in me I can definitely do it anyways I'm sitting in front of my laptop right now so that I can finalize um, my order for from Mr. Price home I just want to get a few bedding things um, and by finalize, I mean just make sure that everything that I want in my cart is in my cart, and then I'll only check out on Friday, which is the day that I'm actually moving because I'm full of good check out now, and then I put the address for there, and then <laughs> it gets here in like a day because Mr. Price Home is really quick, guys. Um, actually, Mr. Price in general, like they're quite quick with their delivery for online orders. Well, for me, they have been so. Imagine it gets there, I check out tonight, it gets there tomorrow, and they're like, who the hell are you talking about? We don't know who that is. So, I'm just going to check out on Friday. Anyways, I'm going to show you guys what I have so far. So, I got... If you know me, you'll know that, like, if you've been following me for a while, and you follow me on Instagram as well, you'll know that I had continental pillows, but I hated them. Like, they're so flimsy, they just have no structure. They're not cute. I don't like them. So I gave those away. I'm getting king pillows instead. Um, so I'm getting four of those, two for each bed. And then I'm getting base wraps because right now the beds are brown. And I feel like having them white would just be more aesthetic. But I'm not going to get a fro. So <laughs> bed wrap is better and cuter. And then pillowcases for the... King pillows. So that's my cart right now. And then right now I'm wanting to add mattress protectors. But yeah, that'll be me for the rest of the night. Um, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yes, 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 yes. Muyile is day two of packing. Guys, the morning I have had. It's like 12 now. And I was up at 9. Sorry, just had PTSD. So, give we like guys in a pick and pay, pick and pay, but say now, boy, I don't even know, like, I don't even know how to translate this for you guys, but like, baby, like, say, like, hey, boy, wow, baby, for no language, for boxes that they're supposed to give me for free, boxes that they're not gonna use, boxes that are just gonna go get recycled when I could use them. Are you just, hey, boy, dude? So, 
And I feel a pana. I'm like, yeah, can I please get boxes? The lady I, I came to last time said I must come in the morning. Um, they're like, uh, they're packed away in a container and we can't get a, we can't uh, get access to them uh, because of the container that that they're in. And I'm just thinking, why can't they just open the freaking container? What's what's the chat? Um, and then they're like, uh, go to the loading dock, delivery side, what, what. Mind you, this is outside now the mall. So I had to drive around to go to that place. And I'm like, yeah, they told me I must come this side if I want to get some boxes. They're like, no, you're supposed to get them from inside. I was just like, you know what? Keep your f***ing boxes, guys. Keep them. Because, wow. Oh my god. It was wow. Wow. Yo, they hacked me. They hacked me. I was like, you know what? I'm not doing this shit anymore. I'm gonna go buy some boxes. <laughs> so I was originally gonna go to storage, but my friend Yolanda told me that Westpac has. So I did some Googles and I got prices and Westpac was cheaper and closer. So I went to West Westpac instead. So Places that have boxes that I know of that I can tell you guys, Postnet. Postnet has boxes that are 65 Rand each, which is the most expensive, and I'd only recommend them if you only just want one, um, and if all the other places are too far from you. Um, storage next. Storage boxes are 40 Rand for the same size as the 65 Rand one um, at Postnet. And yeah, they're 40 Rand for one. Um, they do have like a special if you buy eight you get two free whatever the vibes I don't know if that's just for the month though or if it's a thing but yeah um, and then there's Westpac which was cheapest across the board I think it's basically the same size box as the other two stores but for 30 Rand and it is for 10 they're like 200 and something so it's a bargain um yeah so i got 10 from westpac and here they are i will build one now so that we can see and then i'll confirm for sure if the sizing is actually the same so this is she i think they're all relatively the same size this one is just a little longer so not as wide uh the other ones are wider they're more like a square shape whereas this one She's giving rectangular a little bit, but I think they would fit the same amount of things. So, go to Westpac, yes. So my smart ass just got a call from the Wi-Fi company and they actually wanted to install the Wi-Fi tomorrow. And I was like, no, can you please come on Friday because it's for a new apartment and they're only gonna give me the keys on Friday. Um, so the timing of it is gonna be perfect because they're gonna install it and then I'll never would have lived there without Wi-Fi. <laughs> um, so I'm really happy about that. <laughs> you know, I feel like this video is becoming like a tips and tricks video because look at all the look at all the gems I'm giving you. Basically, set up your Wi-Fi before you even move, and then tell them the date that's suitable with you. In terms of today, we've made strides, very giant step for mankind i'm freaking exhausted guys this is a lot of work um yeah but um i'm calling it a night when i show you my progress so this is what it's looking like this is what it's giving look at all of this oh my god i decided to do laundry and then it rained so that's fun but listen listen I stick, I, listen today we made strides okay this is growth yesterday i did absolutely nothing i went to my nails and that was that today i'm here with eloa she's out of focus <laughs> hi eloa <laughs> Um, we are packing together. She is here to be my slave. Um, <laughs> and I did get my keys today, but that's going to be in the next vlog. Because this vlog is for packing. So, we're just going to get on with the get up. Maybe I should end the vlog here, hey. I mean, how much more packing can I show them?
Like, but it's the a... same thing like over and over again but we'll see okay i'm not gonna end it yet yeah, don't end but it yeah. just know that right now Maybe. we're packing okay that's what we do like, so where are we off to uh right now we're gonna go put gas oh sh <laughs> because uh we on reserve without us up and downing but look at the back yeah <laughs> that's so emotional <laughs> Well, that guy's made me overload the car. It's not overload. Yeah, but that's the, look, as long as I can see my review, Mara. Exactly. We did good. We packed <gasps> most it's of so the tiny things. What the fuck, you guys? Oh. Strides, okay. Uh, we made strides today, took some stuff to the new apartment, and yeah, I feel good. It's like a quarter to seven, guys, and it's there's still light outside. Yeah, global warming is real, it is not a conspiracy. Get the global warming, we haven't had anything to eat oh, the entire shit, yeah, day, and, and it's, it's seven, seven, seven That's p.m., gross. seven in the night time. All when you come alive, say bye. Catch you on, I don't even know, whatever's next. <laughs> it's giving, I am my mother's son. Um, today is the last day of packing because the moving trucks come tomorrow. So this is the last day I'll be filming for this vlog. And then I'll catch you on the next one. Um, so right now I'm about to go to the shops um, to get some washing powder and mop, a mop. Um... And then we're gonna tackle my room. The reason I'm getting washing powder is because I want to wash my linen before I put it on in the new place. And then the mop is obviously because I want a new mop for the new place. <laughs> so now it's operation my room. And wow, scary. I'm gonna do what Loa made us do yesterday first and take things that can go into my car and then I'll come back and pack so that I can see what I'm actually doing. So I'm gonna take my shoe boxes to the boot. Let's go. Progress report. Look at it, look at it. We making moves, ma, we making moves. And uh, if you come this side, the bathroom is uh, pretty much empty. Don't know if you guys know, but I had stuff there. That's product, I will clean it. And I started with the kitchen. Doesn't look all that promising right now, but every single cupboard up there is empty. So, yeah, um, I've made moves. Um, I'm also stoked because I've done all the laundry that I wanted to do. There she is, Otto Whites. And yeah, now so now I'm gonna head out. I'm gonna go drop a load at home because I've been loading the car, as I told you guys. Um, so I'm gonna go drop that load off and then come back and see what needs to be done. Hopefully when I come back, I'm gonna have reinforcement, AKA Yolanda. <laughs> so yeah, we have reached the final stages of all the moving of things I'll be doing for the truck um, and packing. Guys, I'm sorry about the lack of footage. Packing is a lot of work, one. So for me to keep getting different angles of what I'm doing was just gonna make it take longer and I was already getting anxious. We're gonna keep those because they have the slips in them. Um, I was already getting anxious at the fact that I'm not going to make it on time to be out of here tomorrow. But we've made good progress. I've brought in reinforcement. Say hi, reinforcement. Uh, reinforcement. <laughs> hi, guys. Snacks. <laughs> um, yeah, so, yeah, boy, shelf. It's done. 
which was the main goal for today. I'm gonna take this now and the side table and same in this room, the side table and the lamp and the bathroom is completely empty. It's just got my cosmetics bag, which I'll put in my suitcase. Oh, I'm gonna take the bath mat too. And then it's just the kitchen. So, but yeah, it is what it is. And it do what it do and it does it. Nkatele, this is not for children. It's kind of moving. That's it. That's all I have to say. This is me from the next vlog coming to wrap this vlog up because they're overlapping and happening literally in consecutive days. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what you're excited to see in this moving series. Okay, because more vlogs are coming. I'm going to go sort out the issues that you're going to see in the next vlog and <laughs> I'll see you then. I love you all so much and thank you very much for watching. Mwah.